Baja 1000 homework starts now. We're here in Ojos Negros for day one of the pre-run. We're gonna run about 210 miles today, so um, some pretty fun stuff. Hit, hit the crossover road all the way over to the beach today, so looking forward to that and ending up in uh, San Catin this evening. So I'm um, putting in about 200 miles and time to get some homework. talk right now. We came all the way to Valley T. Best carne asada tacos in my opinion. Carne con queso. They're freaking close. So we're eating Sammy's out of the back of the race. When you're on the open road like this, you gotta be careful. I almost just set this dog meat dog shit. <laughs> <laughs> Not dog shit. I don't put dog shit on my sandwich. Um, when you're on the open road, you can only bring stuff that survives in the cooler. So it's a pretty basic setup, mayo, mustard, a little heavy on the mustard because you're low on condiments. Turkey, cheese, and then you gotta put some peppers. There's gotta be some crunch in there. Um, then top it off with some chips for a little extra crunch. That's, that's, the, that's the desert sandwich. We ended our day yesterday in San Catin here at uh, Hotel Mission. So, got in late, got in uh, at dark. So, just trying to get all the miles in while we can. Only pre-run for two days. So, trying to get 466 pre-run miles in in two days is a little bit of a stretch. But, uh, man, this is why I love Baja. Ocean in the background, waking up and doing uh, roughly 230 more miles today to uh, finish out this day two pre-run. Longest section we're doing of the day with that without being on highway, no no um, chase truck in sight. Um, about eight miles behind us, let, wheel bearing let go in the razor. Um, caught it just in time. <laughs> limped it back eight miles. There's an access road we were able to take, limped it in, and we ended up at this bar and restaurant cafe in the middle of nowhere that has cold drinks, Wi-Fi. Um, so I think we're gonna be able to get a hold of our chase truck. We can't get hold of him yet, so she's actually gonna take Abel for a hundred bucks, 30 miles down the road to tell Bacon, hey, we're broken down, come bring the trailer back. So it's crazy how Baja works sometimes. The people here are so nice. Dude, Robbie Gordon is coming to save us. This will never He's happen. He's pulling in, dude. This is not happening. Robbie Gordon is pulling in right now. 